The Kingdom of Majapahit embraces the island of Java, Bali, Sumatra, Nusa Tenggara, Sulawesi, Maluku, and a very big part of Southeast Asia. The world sees Majapahit as a unifier. It integrates kingdoms divided by the seawater called Nusantara, the islands the world knows as Indonesia. There was a man behind the great kingdom of Majapahit, Gajah Mada. With Amukti Palapa, he swore to unite Nusantara. In his Amukti Palapa, his strategies for Majapahit's expansion is not only focusing on the growth of Java, but also Nusantara's strength, maritime. The strength of Majapahit's navy builds the kingdoms to one powerful empire. Ujung Galu Port was the main station of the empire, which is now known as Tanjuk Perak in Surabaya. Ships of Majapahit modified Mongolians as they once tried to invade Majapahit. They are made more slender and four times bigger than the actual size. This eases the ships to change sail. Armed with Chetbans, Majapahit was feared by the enemies. With the strength of 400 ships, Majapahit started their biggest expedition. Sweet victory! They reached their triumph. With minimum bloodshed, Gajamada used culture and adaptation to unify the kingdoms. He was the great and reliable man of Majapahit. Majapahit had proven to the world they had built a great archipelago kingdom. A man with the mind of Gajamada will make Indonesia thrive once more.